Hi, I'm Nat from Magic Beans. Today we're going to be talking about the Up a Baby Vista versus the Ostlin Entourage. If you have any questions during the video, leave me a comment or you can email me at questions at mbeans.com. Here at Magic Beans, we are here to help you find the stroller that is right for you, so watch on to find out. So, Up a Baby Vista is obviously a tried and true favorite. Everybody that you know has one sister, brother, sister in law, yoga teacher. The nice thing about this is it's a really nice single stroller on its own. So the, when you buy a Vista, you get the frame, the seat, and the bassinet. The bassinet is not only really adorable, but it is actually overnight rated. So potentially with the stand, you could use this as where baby sleeps for the first six months or until they start to have the neck control and they start to peer up and out and over. The bassinet will click directly into the stroller, super easy. We take the seat off, bassinet goes right on top. One hand to remove as well. You could also use an infant car seat. If you get the upper baby car seat, it will click onto these same two connection points. Same with the stroller seat. For a double stroller, we do have to change things just a little bit. These are upper adapters. Basically, they raise the first seat up by like about six inches. That will give the two kids a little bit more room. There's little dots on the bottom of these. The little dots correspond to the little dots on your stroller, which is handy for those of us that can't remember which goes where. We are going to raise the seat up. And the second seat goes down here. Just a quick note, these two seats, while they look identical, are not identical. This seat will hold up to about 40, 45 pounds. This seat will only hold up to like 35. That means that potentially if you have a three-year-old and three-year-old is still kind of wants the stroller, um, but you have a newborn, you may have to put your newborn down below with the bassinet and have your toddler up here. That's because if you look at the way the Vista is built, if you put too much weight down here, it's going to become very top heavy. It's going to be very hard to turn. There is an option to put the bassinet or the car seat down here, so not to worry. Still definitely an option if your first kid is a little bit older, if you do want this as a double stroller. It also has a kickboard accessory, which will go right here, where an older kiddo can stand and hang on, which means potentially you could have three kids riding along on this stroller. There is plenty of cargo space. This is a very American stroller. It has a lot of function to it, very easy fold, good sun protection with the UV canopies. So fold on the Vista is very easy. I always extend the handlebar out all of the way because that way it will stand up on these little rubber nubbins on the handlebar. But it's just these two gray tabs on the frame. Pull them both towards you. That unlocks the frame in the middle. You can just bring this down and it clips over on the left hand side right here is the locking mechanism. We can bring this down. To unfold it, all you do is you separate this away from the bar that it is locked to and it will kind of pop out after that. So let's compare that to the Entourage. The Entourage is a pretty cool stroller. So the idea is kiddo can be here for when you are ready for a single stroller. Um, this seat is technically newborn friendly in that it can be reclined down almost flat, which looks like this. However, they do have a car seat adapter if you would rather that will fit Maxi Cozy, Nuna, and Cybex. And those also have a bassinet mode. Underneath the footrest, there is a whole layer of fabric. This will stretch around and pop into snaps all along here. So, over time, you need to add a second seat. You need a little bit more space. It expands, which is awesome. So, over here, we have our second seat. It can be left up in sort of a rest position or it can come down. This will expand out large enough that we can have both seats reclined for when both kids are sleeping. But admittedly, this may be a little bit long. So we can also bring this up and there is an intermediate position. 
right here for when you want it as a double. For twins, this is twin friendly. You can have two car seat adapters, one here and one here. For a combined weight, the stroller will carry up to 150 pounds. The front seat will do about 50, the seat 35. This storage compartment they give you, which is awesome, it just plugs in right here and can be retractable depending on how long you, you need your stroller. Just comes in right here. This will carry 35 pounds. There's also quite a bit of storage in the bottom. There are accessories to hold even more stuff. The biggest thing with this that we really like is that there's a lot of suspension built in. You can really feel it, especially in the front wheels. There's some good shock in the swivel which means that this is going to be able to tackle tougher terrain, it means it's gonna be a smoother ride even as it gets heavier. For the fold, you can fold this with the second seat on. We have to bring it into the rest position. There is a lever on the back here which controls the recline. We push on that and we pull up on the strap in the seat. You get a good angle with this. There we go. We bring this in. Right here by the front seat, there are two clips. We pull them both towards us, and that will collapse down this first seat. There are also two clips over here. Silver button is on the right-hand side. You have to push in the silver button, pull up, and this will fold down too. So comparing, so comparing these two. This one is definitely quite a bit higher up off the ground, which would probably change if we took the second seat off. As far as folding back up, you saw the Vista. For the entourage, something handy too is you can kind of drag this behind you if you would like. So press in the silver button, pull up on the tabs. That brings up the handlebar. And then for this guy, you just need to get kind of a good angle. You kind of pull it towards you and up at the same time with the same tabs you used to fold it. Gets down pretty compact for what it is. There is also a kick seat if your child is a little bit too old for the second seat. This plugs into the same spot. This will come down. Kid can sit on that or stand over on the kickstand. The biggest thing with this is you can load this up with luggage, you can load it up with stuff for the pool, stuff for the beach. This is a stroller that can carry everything. If you have any questions, you can leave a comment or you can email me questions at mbeans.com. If you like this video, give us a thumbs up or you can subscribe and see more comparisons of other Baby Gear products.